I got mainly two heels on the cellar in the middle. Um, one bedrock is a gnes, one is orthogness, and one is granite. You have to understand that they are made with the same elements, felspata, mica, and quartz. It's just a difference of heat and pressure. So gnes and orthogness are metamorphic stones. Okay, you get gnes, you get a lot of pressure and heat, so very, very small, small stones. Uh, the orthogness in the middle of a hill, which are very bigger stone, uh, very square, that's why it's called orthogness, uh, very, very square, very massive. And granite is granite, so it's an eruptive stone. Uh, so you got three different stones, three different bedrocks that gives you three different wines, simply. Agnes gives some very soft wines uh, with uh, uh, more on the fruit, okay? Very easy to drink, maybe the three, five years after the bottling. Uh, Autogness gives some massive wine, very full body, with very warm, uh, spicy, often spicy. Um, from three to ten years in your cellar, you can drink now, but you can, you can edge very well. And uh, the granite is more like a flinty wine, uh, very straight, linear wine uh, on the rock. Yeah, and you can age this bottle more than 10 years. Do you farm them differently? No, it's the same work. Same work, same hill, same exposure, same plowing, all is the same. No work in the cellar except the bedrock, Sydney. <laughs>